Keanu Reeves' critically panned erotic thriller Knock Knock is entirely forgettable. But the film starring then-newcomer Ana de Armas has improbably set the stage for an unforgettable portrayal of Marilyn Monroe. Somehow, when blonde writer and director Andrew Dominic saw 2015's Knock Knock, he knew that Cuban-born de Armas, who played one half of the seductive and dangerous duo terrorizing Reeves, had what it took to portray screen icon Monroe. Magically, de Armas has brought this unlikely vision to life in Blonde, which arrives Wednesday on Netflix amid critical praise for her performance in the controversial NC-17 film. It's very strange, says de Armas, 34. Andrew saw Knock Knock and said that I had this Marilyn quality. That it was exactly what I looked like. It feels like serendipity because when I did that movie, my English was non-existent almost. So it was kind of meant to be that for some reason we met at the right time. Blonde, everything we know about Netflix and C-17 rated Marilyn Monroe movie the film spent years in pre-production before Armas, the star of Knives Out and No Time to Die, was able to read Dominic's blonde script, based. Despite obvious differences ranging from culture to hair color, de Armas felt instantly connected to Norma Jean, who would rise to superstar de Mesmin Robot turn victim to the Hollywood machine before dying of a barbiturate overdose at age 36. I knew I had a lot of work creating this icon. But I felt like I knew what was going on underneath, the core of who she was, says de Armas. I was just happy that Andrew focused on the performance, not the accent, not the brown hair. He was just thinking, oh, she feels like Marilyn. Blonde Review, Anna de Armas is a bombshell but Netflix Marilyn Monroe movie is brutal making the Monroe connection was pretty obvious, Dominic insists.